Okay, anyways, welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy, where your dreams become reality, and where reality is terrible. Because of poachers and stuff, you know? Oh, we still got that drip drip. Um, okay, so I'm hoping... <sighs> I'm hoping we can get... What am I looking at? Hello? Oh. Um, I'm hoping we can get, uh, Novada Kedavra today. Let's see what we got here. Dodge, yep, 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 everything's feeling good. Whoa, got some gear, okay. Um, do we just have, like, a lot of stuff we need to sell? What are we rocking with here? 10 out of 36? Eh, eh. Ooh. Ooh, more offense. We'll take that and we will do a new enchantment there. Terrible hat. Nothing. Nothing. New outfit, huh? Oh, oh, look at all that defense. What do we got here? Okay, so the uh, the outfit is ancient magic, and the other one is cursed damage. Uh, what was I rocking here? A little fingerless? Eh, I think we were doing that. Sorry, sorry. I gotta get this done. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta look the part. You know, gotta look the part. Gotta act the part. We'll we'll get into some actual stuff in a second. Oops, that is actually what I wanted to do. Um, so we're rocking with this right now. This needs to be... Ancient Magic 3. Easel fur? Easy peasy, yo. What else we got? Uh, well, what did we change? Gloves, gloves, gloves. Uh, this needs to be Unforgivable 3, yes. <clears throat> Like, I don't know how to find all the rest of these. Like, significantly increased damage of all spells. Concentration 3. Well, like, where do I find this stuff? Concentration 3. Look, look that up for me, somebody, please. We need to concentrate. Okay, what do we got for quests here? Fucking nothing at all. Level 21. Guess I'm working. Um, let's, uh... Hello? Is he just here? Oh, Mance is just nearby. Okay. You can find this trait randomly on gear, or you can craft it. Yeah! I have an easel for you. I have all that. I just am trying to find the actual trait itself. So apparently I just have to find it randomly on gear. That seems a little... Mm, I, uh, I, not good. I don't like that. Like, it should be something you can just find, like, in a chest in the world, you know? Like, oh, now now I know how to create uh, this. I found a recipe or something, you know? Some shit like that. Hello there. What's up, Amit? Hello, Amit. Do I recall you saying that you speak gobbledygook? I did. I mean... I do. Speak it. Is this to do with the goblin I saw you with in Hogsmeade? It is. His name is Lodgok. 
We could use your help with something. He's waiting for me near a goblin mine. Would you be willing to help? Of course. How exciting. I mean, well. Yes, we have the loom. That's what I just changed all the those two things were. If it helps, he's a friend of Serena's. Good to hear. Good to hear. If Serena trusts him, then I feel much better. Is it me or does it sound a little racist that goblins speak gobbledygook? Should be able to make it. No, 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 no. I need to like find the tree. Like, look at look at like the thing that you said. You can find this trait randomly on gear. I think you have to like find it on gear first and then that, that unlocks it so you can like use it later. I don't know. Lodgok is waiting. Shall we go? Of course. I just want to check the pronunciation of a couple of key terms first. So I will meet you there. Those two are not enabled. I don't know, my man. Meet Lodgok near the mine entrance. You gotta go and, and add them. Holy balls! Oh, okay. We're going over here, I guess. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Off on another adventure, are we? Off on another adventure, are we? Well, that's being weird. Uh, can I just... Where am I meeting this dude? Yeah. Oh, let's pick some of this up while we're here, actually. Off on another adventure, are we? Sorry, sorry, sorry. Off on another adventure, are we? A friend who speaks gobbledygook is meeting us. Before he arrives, perhaps you could tell me why we're here. Of course. Unfortunately, <laughs> presenting Ranrock with the helmet of Earthbot did not have the effect I'd hoped. Because he knew the details surrounding its plunder, he presumed I'd had help from a witch or wizard in retrieving it. Uh, what did we do? Oh, we helped this guy like a millennia ago. How else did he expect Goblin Kind to get the helmet back? Seems he has no interest in making amends with you. I'm afraid we do not have the luxury of rational expectation when it comes to Ranrock. Gives bad guy vibes. Yeah, this dude's going to betray us big time. Bradbore. An ancestor of Ranrock's, renowned metal worker. If we We're going to toss Lodgok off this cliff. Not long ago, Ranrock sent me to collect a recently unearthed set of Bragbor's journals. They described repositories that Bragbor had been commissioned to build for a group of witches and wizards. What do you mean, repositories? Large, magically fortified receptacles crafted from goblin metal. Ranrock recruited others to help me locate the repositories. We were to search anywhere that was connected to five names mentioned in the journals. Rackham, Fitzgerald, Bacar, Morganock, and Rookwood. Rookwood Castle. That is mm. where we began our search. Why does Ranrock care so much about these repositories? He cares about what they contain. For centuries, wizards have refused to share their magical knowledge with goblins. <laughs> Your kind will not even let us carry wands. Thus, many goblins, myself included, have spent our lives mistrusting wizard kind. Ranrock was convinced that the repositories contained a magical power that wizards wanted to keep for themselves. He was, is, determined to take it for goblin kind. But he's... Here comes my friend Armit. Probably best to continue our conversation later. I still think this dude is sus. It is an honor, sir. You speak gobbledygook. Why, because he's Indian? Enough. Please do not tell me that was meant to be gobbledygook. Yo, we're fucked. I, uh, well, yes. Perhaps my pronunciation was a bit off. I imagine certain dialects differ. 
Pronunciation is not the issue. I barely recognize that as language. I trust you can read gobbledygook better than you can speak it? I can, Sir Lodgok. Just Lodgok. Thankfully, we only need someone who can decipher written plans, since I cannot join you in the mine. Why not? What written plans? And why can't you come with us? We need some idea of what Ranrock knows or is plotting. I suspect a careless loyalist may have left plans behind. And I'm unable to join you because I cannot risk anyone reporting my presence to Ranrock. All you need to do is not be seen. Either by the eye above the enchanted door or a loitering loyalist. Yeah, tell me about the door, my guy. The door will not open while the eye can see you. You and your friend must be invisible to it to gain access. From what I know of wizard magic, that shouldn't be too difficult to achieve. Okay. I will await your return. No, no, that's that was my Discord. I don't know. I shall see you soon. Enter La Goblin Mine. Gotta be paranoid. Nah, is me, is me. Ashwinder eggs. The door is looking at us. Oh. Hey. Enter the mind's eye. Get it? Like the like the the mind, but also really the like the mind. Reality. A real goblin mind. It's even grander than I had expected. We're gonna toss some goblins in here, bro. I cannot believe I met a goblin. Let's just learn what we can and get out. Look at this lift. Impressive workmanship for so simple a device. Impressive workmanship aside, it's the only way forward. Whoa, I mean, almost did not make it in there. I still can't believe we're inside a real goblin mine. Hmm. I've read about mines like this. But seeing one is something else altogether. Yeah. Come on, Ami. Get on the thing. Keep your wits about you, Ami. I'll get you through this mine. Yeah, like this. Bang. Bang! Ouch. Just get fucking murdered, bro. I'll get us through here safely, I'll meet. Oh. You have my word. Oh, because I crucioed him? Sorry, bro. Hey, <laughs> <I>, uh. <laughs> I'm a little, uh, uh nope, uh, yeah, don't, don't worry about this. Don't worry about, uh, don't worry about that. Another door? What does that do? Hmm, okay. What does that do? Bring out these nuts. Rebellion. 
Bro, I need all the cash I can get. Like a character from one of the adventure books I read during the summer holidays. Let's be holding it. Around, See if we can find any plans. Bound to be plans around here somewhere. Remind me about any plans. A schematic. They're building something. I can't quite make it out. Curious. Let me know if you see any more plans or schematics. We can't return to Logdok empty-headed. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, there was a settings change I needed to make. Uh, what was it? Something that lets me aim off screen. Okay, found something else. Fascinating to see gobbledygook written in a goblin hand. The flourishes are extraordinary. Revenia. There must be more notes around here. What could they be building? What could they be building? I don't know. Probably some way to like control beasts or something. Like harness, you know, ancient magic and something. Uh, some I don't know. Just a guess. Whoops. Gobbledy gook. Gobbledy gook. Oh, you were up here. Don't follow me, I'm eat. Ready for the fight of your life, bro. We're gonna kill hella people. If I'm translating this correctly, and I think that I am, they're building something rather large. But what? I will get to the bottom of what they've been building down here. Hmm. Rather large, you say. Oh! Oh! How about some of that bitch? Defeat a hundred Goptas? Yeah, fight your friends, bitch. Oh, oops, oops, dodging. Dodging is what we like to do. Slam, slam. This is too much. Stay close. We've handled much worse. Another boiler. This place is more complex than I had expected. Can bring that. Revelia. I wonder if the boiler powers the lever. I suspect it must. 
I'm gonna... Uh... Another schematic. What are they going to build? This mine is too small for whatever it is. The boiler activated that handle. See it? Bum 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 bum. Okay. Um. We want to get up there, and I think. That's just potions. I think we want to go through this so we can go get the chest over here. I see. Accio should easily engage the handle. Marvelously clever. Oh, good. We found some stairs. What lever are you talking about, bro? Oh, that thing over there? Like, what did that do? Clump. Devil snare. Nasty stuff if we're not careful. Not an entanglement we need right now. Lumos. Lumos. Mind me. Rebellion. They're giving me Dittany leaves right now. Lumos. Lumos. This is this is the right way, right? Then what the hell was over here? Uh, Eat ass, bro. Like, what is this area then? Imagine most goblins to be brilliant and kind. Oh, just a dead end. I see. Okay, so I was going the correct direction. A doy. Alrighty then. Bring on the goblins, I say. Right, your friends. Let's 
Boom! Boom! The hell's going on with my take? What? 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 Oh, another one of these, huh? See, like, why doesn't this one work? Gotta be missing something. It's open, can I pull it? The hell? Yes, 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 yes. I don't really know what those are doing, but Seems important. This is not good. They're building enormous drills. Bigger oh than boy. this mine could contain. Let's get out of here and tell Lord Gok what we found. That's a big ass drill, bro. Yeah, let's let's definitely tell Lord Gok what we found, you know? Oh, this is how we're getting out, question mark? Oh, there's a chest over there. Shit. I need a moment to catch my breath. This was more than I bargained for. I'm glad you came with me, Amit. Now that we know what they're up to, we can get out of here. Alohomora, baby. Aloha Yes, of course. Can bring that. Okay. Quidditch equipment shelf. Sure, why not? Why did it let me get out of here so easily? That is a little sussy. Um, can we please talk about- That wasn't so bad, was it? It was. It really was. I'm afraid I've had enough adventure for one day. For a lifetime, perhaps. Thank you, Amit. I couldn't have done it without you. Now, if you don't mind, I'd like to have a word with Lord Gok. Understood? I'll leave you to it. Your goblin secret... What a baby? Yeah, for me, real. But I get to write the book about this escapade someday. Well, this is the guy that was like, oh, I can't, I can't go into the secret herbology room uh, because 
uh, is scary in there, but I need people to know that I went in there. So can you go get me a plant? Yeah, kind of a kind of a stinky turd. They're building enormous drills. We found their plans. Ranrock must be searching for the repositories. I fear you are correct. Other than Rookwood Castle, however, I do not know where else he plans to search. I've been wondering about something else you said before we entered the mine. Yes? If you share Ranrock's views, then why are you helping me? I expected Rookwood Castle to be deserted when I arrived to begin my search. So I was surprised to find a witch there who had set up a sort of improvised research site. She was studying something so intently that she almost didn't notice me. This is like a legit cutscene. When she looked up, I thought she would react with fear or disdain. But instead, she did something that I will never forget. She was like, I saw a goblin. Moment's hesitation. She smiled and asked me to sit with her. She told me that she was a researcher and showed me a small, oddly shaped... Oh, it was Fig's wife. ...symbol on it. She was certain it was made of goblin metal, but was unable to open it. Fig's wife, for sure. She wanted to work together. Miriam. Yes. But how did you... Professor Fig's wife. He told me of her research, and I know of the container. <sighs> the reverence with which she talked of goblins and their intelligence and skill, it caught me entirely off guard. I'd never been treated with such respect by a witch or wizard. So, to my surprise, I let her study the container if she would allow me to search the castle on my own. We parted ways, with her promising to share what she'd learned. Hmm. More of Ranrock's recruits arrived, and we began to dig, eventually locating the first repository. Ranrock was thrilled with our discovery, but furious when I told him about Miriam. Berated me for trusting a witch, when I heard she'd been killed. You think Ranrock murdered her? I don't want to believe it. But I don't know. Interesting. After that, something shifted in me. I had seen how the power from the repositories was transforming Ranrock. Transforming all of them. I could no longer remain a part of it. Thank you, Lodgov, for telling me this. Hmm. I tell you all of this so that you understand what is at stake. <sighs> Ranrock never found all of Bragbor's journals, but the ones he did find suggest that Bragbor at some point built a repository far greater in size than the one beneath Rookwood Castle. Uh-oh. What you've discovered here today worries me deeply. If Ranrock learns of the location of that repository, I fear we shall be destined for a great war. I guess he is a good guy. Uh... I will find out what Ranrock knows. Watch for my owl. Maybe. I think he's good-ish. to be even more impressive than the last. Come by Spint Witches as soon as you can. You know me. I love a good broom upgrade. 
Please let me fast travel. There we go. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Revelio. I still don't know what to do with this door. Grimistry. I had plenty of opportunities to prove anything I wish. Hello again. Wonderful to see you. As before, I've arranged a special price on the broom upgrade for you. Four thousand dollars. Good thing I have barely that much money. You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you. You're all set with the new upgrade. I can't wait to hear what you think. <clears throat> this may sound presumptuous, but like you want me to, to race back with even more flight details. Yep. <laughs> you know me well. I feel I'm almost there. I just think I can improve broom flight a bit more. Miss Ray's is running a time trial at the South Coast course. Not ideal, really. What with rumors of Ramrock's lot and Ashwinders infiltrating the place. Ashwinders. If you're flying high above them, you should be all right. I think. I'm not worried, Mr. Weeks. I'll see if I can find Imelda. I hope you are able to complete these trials. I have a feeling this final upgrade is going to be a sweeping success. <laughs> Do be careful, of course. Get it, broom. Sweeping. I look forward to our next meeting. All right, let's see what kind of quests we got now. Just this, huh? Okay. Actually, let's 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 get out of Hogsmeade. Perhaps I could test out my new upgrade now. I don't really feel much faster. Hmm. I can't really tell. Look, you can't even land. What kind of gobbledygook is that? There we go. Okay, we need map chamber. Where's Figgy Wiggy? Welcome back. Hello, Professor. I have news. The goblins are looking for something. Another repository. They've built drills to help with their search. Oh, most troubling. Are these repositories like the broken container I found at Rookwood Castle? They are. I fear we have no time to lose. Have a look at the map. Fortunately, the next trial is fairly nearby. Oh. Hogwarts. As you know, I was headmistress in my time. My portrait hangs in the headmaster's office. In fact, I witnessed Professor Black learn of your arrival. 
and I'll confess that I wondered about you. Wait, is the next trial in the headmaster's office? It is. I had hoped that when the time came, the occupant of that office would be of help to us. Unfortunately, this headmaster seems wildly unconcerned with anything but himself. You'll need to access the office while he's away. I understand. Very well. We'll find some way to get in. Good. I shall meet you in my portrait there. Until then. Okay. How will I gain access to the headmaster's office? Perhaps Professor Fig will know what to do. Figgy wiggy. Figgy. Professor Fig, the keepers have shown me where the next trial is. Has something changed? Lodgog and I have learned that the goblins are searching for another repository, like the one we saw at Rookwood Castle. And I discovered that they're building massive drills to help in their search. Professor Fitzgerald seemed very concerned. I see. Ranrock clearly knows even more than we suspected. And, sir, there's something else. Lodgok knew Miriam. He knew Miriam? They encountered each other at Rookwood Castle. She was doing research. That's where she found the container with the port key. Oh, no. But he let her leave with it, despite orders from Ranrock. I don't know what to say. She could win over almost anyone. I want to hear more of this. And, in fact, I'd like to speak with Lodgok directly. But we've no time now. Where is the next trial? Believe it or not, it's in the headmaster's office. Incredible. All right. You'll Look at the artifacting on this dude. I don't know what's going on with this the game. The headmaster's house elf will know it. I've actually met Scroop, but I'm not sure he'll tell me. He's rather devoted to the Black family. He is. So you'll need a disguise. I have just the thing. A polyjuice potion. Oh. You'll look and sound like Professor Black. Wait. Doesn't polyjuice potion require a bit of the person you want to change into? And take ages to brew? It does. So how do you already have <laughs> to change into Professor Black? One never knows when such a thing may come in handy. Let's just say I felt the need to be prepared for anything after my fruitless trip to the ministry on his behalf. Now, time is of the essence. Drink up and I shall explain more. Well, oh, no. It tastes terrible. Great. How do you feel? Uh, incredible. I won't forget that taste anytime soon. <clears throat> How do I sound? Convincing. I've taken the liberty of transfiguring your robes. Hey, thanks. As we discussed, you'll need the password from Scrope, who could be anywhere in the castle. You might look for Professor Kagawa. She's taken to badgering the poor elf about Quidditch in the hopes that he can convince Black to change his mind. Thus far, unsuccessfully. I see. But what if Professor Black sees me? Leave him to me. I shall tell him where to meet a liaison from the Ministry in Hogsmeade. That should give you plenty of time. Thank you, Professor. I suppose we'll meet again in the map chamber. It's rather strange to hear gratitude <laughs> from <laughs> Professor Black. <laughs> I'll see you there. Now to find the Headmaster's house elf. Oh, I can't just, like, do any magic right now.
Do you have a moment, Professor? Professor, I was oh, no. at you. I... Oh, I, um, places to be, Professor Sharp, places to be. Of course, sir. Only... <laughs> You'd asked me about a particular potion, and I... Well, I... I did? I did, yes. Well, spit it out, Sharp. I don't have all day. Probably best not to discuss it here, sir. Hmm. I assure you, Sharp, you may speak freely. Very well. I've brewed the cure for boils you wanted. I can drop it by your office when <laughs> it's convenient. <clears throat> of course, yes. No need for all the cloak and dagger. Simply have a student deliver it. A student. Very well, sir, if you insist. <laughs> I do. And thank you, Sharp. Okay. I hope you've brewed enough for all my boils. Now, to determine which student gets this rather unenviable task. Unenviable task. Going down, down. If you must speak with me, consult my secretaries or what have you. Now move along. I thought I heard the headmaster approaching. Gareth! Uh, uh, Mr. Weasley! What are you doing here? Don't you have uh, somewhere to be? Oh, Professor, yes, of course. All sorts of places I'd rather be right now. <laughs> uh, do you need something from me? I'm looking for my house elf. Surely you've seen him? Ah. The little one-eared fellow. I saw him heading to the Great Hall moments ago. Muttering on about your, um, sterling graces, sir. <laughs> I hear you're getting quite good at those concoctions you brew. I say, why don't you bring a sample of your next batch to my office? I'd like to give it a try. What? Uh, yes, sir. I will. Thank you, sir. Thank you. On your way, Mr. Weasley. Okay, interesting. We're gonna blow him up. Fun for my diary. Well, there's one for my diary. I haven't time for any of you at the moment. None. None at all. Move aside. Who are you talking to? Headmaster? Yeah. What could he want? Mr. Gort! Oh. Where do you think you're going? I beg your pardon, sir. I'm simply on my way outside. Taking the day off, eh? Typical student, wasting the hours away. I... I have to write 20 inches on Dittany, and its uses was heading to the greenhouse. Ah, yes. Mixed with, uh, bubo tuba pus makes a, a fine, uh, mustache paste. Yes, mustache paste. Uh, I find. <clears throat> Are you feeling all right, sir? You don't <laughs> seem yourself. I assure you, I am quite healthy, Gaunt. If I need a medical diagnosis, I shall head to St. Mungo's. Look at this Deffy. Bom. Bom. Something is Deffy. Different. Blindy, I mean. You call that a shine on those boots? Do better. Do better. Professor, a word? Professor Black? Again, it is not too late to reconsider your decision regarding Quidditch. We... We could still have trials and a somewhat shortened season. It would be better than none at all. But the injury, Madam Kogawa. Professor, more than one student has taken a bludger to the head on our pitch. I dare say it knocked some sense into them. And they are fine now. The fact that it happened to be a pure blood, well, that's no reason to... What nonsense! That you would trivialize the health of a student over a, a silly game. A silly game? I... You are quite impossible sometimes, sir. Sir. Oh, good mind to write to the Department of Magical Games and Sports at the Ministry about you. Please do. Idea. I can even provide the parchment should you need it. Now, where is my elf? I... parchment? Very well, I will, and with pleasure. And I spotted Scrope in the Great Hall. Seems to be avoiding me. Hmm, I wonder why. Good day, Madam Kagawa. Doing a good job uh, playing this guy. What did we do to deserve him as a headmaster? 
Wait, I thought I already unlocked this. Hmm. When I witness what passes for magic in these halls, I... Uh, I... Simply mourn for the future of the wizarding world. Why is the school laid out so stupidly? Oh. God damn it. How do I get inside? surprise it's bloom by the way remind me of your area of affinity broom owls are swift approaching charms sir non-verbal spells might work on one that makes me disappear well keep at it broom and before you know it you'll be as invisible as that new fifth year seems to be they're not invisible sir i've seen them near the library in fact they help me with my uh heavy books <laughs> Speaking of invisible, where's my blasted house elf? Something seems a little off with the headmaster. Wasn't this kid just outside? Has anyone seen my ivory handled hand mirror? Of course you haven't. Professor, I need to speak to you. Hello, Professor Black. Ah, Professor Weasley. How, how delightful to see you. Sir? Ah, uh, since I have you here, I wonder if I might, um, speak with you about Professor Fig. Oh, very well. I've decided to give him a bit more, uh, leeway with his time. Leeway, Professor? Are you sure that's wise? I confess I do worry for his students. He's rarely here as it is. And I don't miss him. I realize that, and I'd like to keep it that way. I see. But, sir, if I may, I am wary of how much time the new fifth year seems to be spending away from the castle, supposedly on Professor Fig's behalf. I've heard unsettling rumors of their escapades. Everything from sneaking into the Forbidden Forest to confronting Ranrock's loyalists and Rookwood's lot. <coughs> what? <coughs> Goodness. Well, you cannot believe everything you hear, Professor. No, 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 you cannot. Uh, <clears throat> I mean, I shall keep an eye on Fig. You simply keep doing the wonderful job that you're doing. <laughs> simply wonderful. I... well, I... Um, thank you. <laughs> Anybody who knows her is like, what the hell? Uh, good, good. That'll be all, Weasley. I, I mean, Professor Weasley. Good day. A wonderful job. Leeway for Professor Fig? I shall never understand that. Can you that ought to give Professor Fig some breathing room. From a model claiming to be the mother of a friend of yours, Arty. Professor Black is happy with Scrope's performance as his house elf. Scrope! Oh, greetings, Master. Remind me of the password to my office. Oh, but Master made Scrope swear never to tell anyone. Even Master himself. How dare you question me? I've a mind to give you a matching set of ears. <laughs> uh, yes, sir. Uh, of course, sir. Uh, Scrope begs forgiveness. It is the Black Family motto, Master. Hmm. Right. Of course. I, uh... Master does remember it. Uh... What's the Black Family motto? I'm guessing purity of blood, but I don't, I'm not sure. Let's go it's with this. Pure blood forever, isn't it? Uh, uh, close, Master. Uh, Scrope thinks Master is indeed testing Scrope. Uh, it is always pure. <laughs> Obviously. And, of course, as Master knows, in French. Ah! Yes, of course. Uh, I order you to pronounce it for me. Oh, Master knows that Scrope's French is most pitiful. <laughs> oh, very well. Toujours pure. Uh, there is another matter, Scrope. 
I confiscated this filthy diary from a student. It smells of squid and seawater. Oh, Apollonia's diary. <clears throat> that is quite a surprise, Master. What do you wish Scrope to do with this treasure? Uh, uh, rubbish. <laughs> Whatever you wish, Scrope. It's your treasure. Now, off with you. <laughs> the Polyjuice potion's wearing off. I best get out of sight. <laughs> oh. I just made it all Slytherin stuff. Let's get out of here so nobody can find me. Oh. 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 Just in time. It's wearing off. Fig was right. I can't believe it worked. Now, to speak the password to the gargoyle. Gargoyle? We should speak with Mr. Oh. I can sneak away without drawing my mother's eye. Meet me near Hogsmeade, and we will devise a plan. It's me, Gareth. Do you have a moment? Were you calling me, Gareth? I was. After you helped me with that fupa feather and potions, I reckoned you might be just the person I need. You see, I have an idea for a fizzing... A fizzing wisby. Beverage, but I'm missing a key ingredient. Is it a fizzing wisby? You and your concoctions. I don't know how you come up with these things. It's a gift, truly. So, I suspect the key ingredient in fizzing wisbies is dried billywig stings. I heard there's a store of them in Honeyduke's cellar. I'd get them myself, but my Aunt Matilda has her eye on me. Thinks I need to focus on potions class for a while, not for my own bruise. I was hoping you could follow a secret passage to Honeyduke's cellar and grab a few dried billywig stings for me. Hell yeah. Of course. You never know when you might need a quick means of escape from the castle. Brilliant, thank you. But you should know that it's not exactly quick. It's the secret bit that's helpful. The passage is hidden behind the statue of a one-eyed witch in the third floor corridor. Just tap it with your wand and say, Descendium. I'll see what I can do, Gareth. Fair enough. You shall be the first one to taste my newest brew if you can be of help. Perhaps I can convince a meat to help me with my potions homework. Get my aunt to loosen her reins a bit. I'll need to get those dried billywig stings for Gareth if he's to finish his latest concoction. Rebe A one-eyed witch statue shouldn't be too hard to find. We're gonna just do a quick little uh, fun side quest here. A one-eyed witch statue, huh? This looks like this. a statue. Now, what was the password? Descendio, bro. Descendium. Goodness. Who knew this was all down here? What in the fuck? A lift. Must be how I get down. Looks broken, though. Hogwarts is wildin', man. That seems to have done the trick. Hello. Down we go. There's got to be something bad down here, right? Like a troll or spiders or... Right? Like something, something's going to attack me. me. 
Can't just be fun in games. Spiders it is! Oh, okay. Okay. What is this now? I'm trapped. How am I supposed to get out of here? Hey, yo. Yeet! The problem is we want to go down there. There's a chest down there. Did it for the cash! I missed. Nope. Come on. You dunce. Good. I'm a puzzle pro. Um. So that other hallway, like way the hell back there, what was that? We gotta go back. We gotta go back now and find it. up here. Oh, shit ass. This way? Yeah, this way. Like, what is this? What is this all about? Is this how I came in? Oh, it is how I came in. I'm a freaking idiot. Why did you, why did you let me run all the way back there, huh? You guys are supposed to stop me. Be like, hey, you freaking idiot, don't do that. Where's the big boss I gotta fight? This must be the way. Hmm. I need to find a way to open that gate. Uh Oh, what's up, secret chest? Um, okay, what is this about? Oh, the door's just open. 
Something smells sweet. Must be close to honeydews. There's no way I just like get into Honeydukes and nobody sees me. Hogsmeade, here I come. Right? Find the Billy Billy Wig stings. I can smell the chocolate. Now, where would I find the dried Billy Wig stings for Gareth? I have the dried billywig stings. Now, back to Gareth. I can oh. only imagine how his new recipe is going to turn out. I didn't have to sneak at all, huh? Alright, cool, cool. I'm gonna run all the way back to Hogwarts. Oh boy. And that's why go right back up the path. Okay, okay. Bye, secret tunnel. Gotta find Kerith. Hello? Oh, this way. Oh, I see. Bye now, demiguys. Hello again. Were you able to get to Honeydukes? Hello, Gareth. I have those dried billywick stings. You got them. Incredible. Happy to help. Here you go. This is brilliant. Can't wait to get started. Thank you again. I'll let you know when I brewed my first batch of fizzing whiz beer. Fizzing whiz beer. We're going to Hogsmeade. Where? Oh, up here. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Oh, not actually in Hogsmeade. Okay. Fizzing Whizbeer. What are you up to now? What are you up to now? Okay, yeah, this is actually faster.
Damn. I should dismount here. Are you ready to put an end to Halo? Sure, bro. I'm ready to do what's needed to take Harlow down. I know you have a plan. We must gather information from the friends of Mr. Bickle that Archie and Mrs. Bickle mentioned. Agabus Philbert, Otto Dibel, and Mr. and Mrs. Rabe. All right. I suggest that you speak with each of them while I head to the Hogshead. I saw some Ashwinders heading there. And as my mother would never go near the Hogshead, she is less likely to learn of my activities than if I were to wander the village questioning its residents. Very well. I'll speak with them. See what I can learn. I knew I could rely on you. We need to know how they are being blackmailed by Rookwood and Harlow. Meet me here after you have spoken with them. Hopefully by the time you return, I will be able to move a bit more freely. Going up. Oh uh, yes, hello, Mrs. Rabe. Oops, didn't mean to drink. Sorry, just some liquid courage. Mrs. Rabe, I wondered if I might speak with you about Theophilus Harlow. Theophilus. I'm the Bickles and I'm trying to gather evidence against him. Poor Joanna and little Archie. And now Harlow has taken my darling Isco. What do you mean? Why? <laughs> I'm a security guard at Gringotts, and my husband is a curse breaker for them. Harlow mm -hmm. approached me about helping him extort my colleagues into giving him treasures from the vaults. And you declined? Of course I declined. Repeatedly. I thought they'd given up until I came home one night and found my husband gone and a note affixed to my door with a knife. The note stated right. that I only had a few days to reconsider helping with some banking needs and that my husband would appreciate it if I acted quickly. But the help Harlow wants is help that I cannot give. And my dearest Isco is paying the price. Don't worry, I'll kill all of them. Thank you, Mrs. Rabe. Knowing the lengths that Harlow will go to is helpful, albeit more than disturbing. Mr. Bickle was trying to help us, but now he's gone. I don't know what to do. I shall do all I can to get evidence against Harlow, Mrs. Rabe. Very well. Here's the note I received. You must be careful as well. Please don't put yourself in danger. I am the danger. Helping us with our banking needs. We've given you ample time to reach a decision on your own, but we're beginning to lose our patience. We know your husband would appreciate it if you were to see the value in our working together. Shall we expect a response by week's end? Best to keep this between us if you understand our meaning. Another like... Worth hanging on to. Thank you. Oh, Anybody that sees that is going to be like... Mr. Bickle's other two friends. Oh yeah, that's not suspicious at all. Freaking idiots. This this like magic police woman, detective, whatever the hell she is. Not not good at her job. I should check that. Yeah, but, 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 but please tell me you didn't take it. But perhaps it's been here all along. Mr. Dibble, may I speak with you? It's about Theophilus Harlow. I have nothing to say about him. Uh may I interest you in a stunning cravat today? Please, sir, I would like to help. I spoke to Mrs. Bickle. You know the Bickles? Mm, all right, but we must be discreet. Can't have Mr. Hill hearing this. I know Mr. Hill. He was kind to me the day of the troll attack. Oh, he's a good man. But even he wouldn't understand about Harlow. It started a few weeks ago. I was distracted, reading a note when you know who came into the shop. I hid the note behind the counter and offered to help him. He stared at me for a moment, then asked me to check on an order he placed. I went into the storeroom to check on what turned out to be a non-existent order. When I returned... Non-existent order, of course. Note. What was in the note? It was a note from Rosie Hill, Mr. Hill's daughter. You see, we've been, well, 
secretly engaged these past six months. What? We haven't told Mr. Hill yet. I dare say he has higher hopes for her. Harley That's fucked. Me in no uncertain terms that my relationship with Rosie, not to mention my employment here, depended upon my cooperation. What did he ask you to do? It all happened so quickly. In an instant, he took a very expensive scarf from the counter, pocketed it, and smiled. He said, your secret is safe as long as I can supply my lady friend with delightful items like this every so often. I've been able to cover for his request until now with some creative bookkeeping, but I can't keep it out for much longer. I'm terrified to say anything. I could never live without Rosie. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. So, so this dude, he's just extorting for like expensive things and being like, "Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell this guy that you're engaged." The other one. He kidnapped people. There seems to be a different level of, uh, I don't know, blackmail going on here between these two groups. Thank you for telling me. I'm gathering evidence to take Harlow down. I was like, oh, you know what? I'm going to take a scarf. It's like, I'm going to steal this human being until you help me. And incredibly dangerous. As for Rosie's letter, should you happen upon it, I have committed it to memory. You may destroy it immediately. Understood. Immediately. Now hurry off before Mr. Hill returns. We're on the right track. Now to find the last of Mr. Bickle's friends. Hmm. Agabus Filbert must be around here somewhere. Hello there. Excuse me, Mr. Filbert. I wondered if I might speak with you about your dealings with Theophilus Harlow. I hope to ease Mrs. Bickle's mind by gathering evidence against him. Oh, tragic what happened to Bickle. He wanted me to speak out against Harlow for an act of violence committed against me. But I feared Harlow's retaliation, and so I refused. If you had spoken out against him as Mr. Bickle asked, perhaps Harlow would be knocked away by now. Perhaps. But uh, perhaps I would have suffered a similar fate. You said that Harlow committed an act of violence against you. Could you tell me what happened? It's going to be Before something my stupid. Extraordinary wife, Dulcibella, passed away. She had just completed a small book of Dulcibella as a surprise for her birthday, one she never had the chance to celebrate. I had the book beautifully bound and plated in gold. One day, Harlow came calling to punish me for having spoken out against the Neanderthals that comprise Rookwood's lot. Before I knew it, I'd been petrified, and Harlow was rifling through my home. He found the book of poetry, with its exquisite gold plating. I watched helplessly, lying there in my entranceway as he walked away with the book, laughing as he went. I was shaken to my core. Still am, to be honest. I imagine you fear Harlow retaliating again. But do you mind if I share this information with Officer Singer? <sighs> I suppose I have no choice. This extortion can't go on forever. You can pass it on to anyone who may be willing to help. She's not gonna do shit. Harlow does not like people talking, as you already know. I've spoken with Mr. Bickle's friends. Now to find Natty. Now to find Natty. Whoops. Is that my 
like Natty to be late. She said she was going to the Hogshead. Perhaps I'll find her there. Oh no. He must be around here somewhere. Uh oh. That he's wound. She can cast without it. She wanted me to find this. She's in trouble. Velio will show me where she was taken. Oh, fucking balls. Revelio. There's a page. Oh, wait. Footsteps. Matty must have been taken this way. I need to find her quickly. I'm gonna bust some fucking chumps for right now. Footprints led to this room. There must be another way forward. All right, so I need to find other things as well. Why, though? Like, what's wrong if I get seen? Can't I just fucking kill all these guys? <laughs> Yo, that's a dope cloak, though. Damn, can I get that? Here's the poem. Book of poems that was taken from Agabus Filbert. He'll okay. be thrilled to have this back. Oh, 
Man, imagine trying to do this stealth. Like, come on now. Like, where does this go? Speak to her again. Perhaps she'll tell us where we can find that friend of hers. She's determined to say nothing. Bossing deal with her when he arrives. Ah. Get rocked. Rebellion. I didn't find... the other thing. The love letter. Did I miss it somewhere? to be in here. No, literally just cash, huh? Hmm. Okay. There's st oh, there's stairs up here. Okay. There it is. Otto Dibble's love letter from Rosie. He wanted me to destroy this if I found it. Okay, let's destroy it then. Ah, the love letter. Okay, can't, uh, can't destroy it. Oh, you know what? Oops. Can I light this up and burn it in there? No, no, all right. Well, all right, Natty. Mr. Rabe, Daisy told me you'd been abducted. She spoke with my wife. How is she? Worried about you. Are you all right? I am all right. Thank you for coming. What a dapper man. These locks are cursed, and there's an anti-apparition jinx on the cells. Even Natty's skill with wandless magic cannot free us. I need you to find my wand. Use mine. We'll find yours together once you're out of there. I need my wand for this. Using one with which I have no connection may not work as well or as quickly. And we cannot risk detection. I shall do my best. Any idea where it might be? It's nearby. I can sense it. Understood. I'll find it. Your friend Natty. 
was not able to summon them. It must be blocked or something. Hello? Blocked by what? Oh, hello. Interesting. Mr. Rabe's wand. He'll be glad to have this back. Uh, I'm gonna keep it for myself. Mr. Rabe, I found your wand. Well done. I knew it was nearby. Now, you best stand back. One never knows how a curse will react to being broken. Let's see what you got, buddy. That's it. Thank you, Mr. Isco. My pleasure. And thank you, my friend. We owe our lives to your bravery. True I that. I'd be too weak to disapparate with you both, but I can try. You go ahead. Find Officer Singer. We will get out of here on our own. Very well. But be careful. Thank you, my young friends. Be prepared for a fight. These Ashwinders must pay. Bro, I fucking killed a thousand of these dudes. Like, they're all dead. Why, why, who, who are we fighting? Uh, is this the right way? Oh, yeah, yeah. You with me, Natty? Natty, where are you at, girl? And put an end to Halloween. Where the hell did you come from? Oh, hello. I, own I. I should have known. And you, the troll dispatcher. Oh, thank goodness the two of you are safe. Isco Rabe told me a couple of students had rescued him. Should have known it was you two. Is yeah, you should have. Right? He is. I sent him home to his wife. Miss Onai, your mother will not be pleased to learn that you're still risking your safety pursuing these dangerous men. Actually, Officer Singer, Natty and I learned of several Hogsmeade residents who've had their lives threatened by the Ashwinders. In addition to abducting Mr. Rave to blackmail his wife and Natty, Rookwood and Harlow have also extorted Agabus Filbert and Otto Dibble. Uh, I will look into all of that. As for the two of you, I appreciate what you're trying to do, but you are taking great risk. Bro, you guys aren't doing shit about the Ashwinders. Handle the Ashwinders. With all due respect, officer, the authorities haven't done much about any of this. There's more to taking down an organization like the Ashwinders than simply storming in and hauling them off based on a few accusations. I don't know. I must insist that you leave them to us. We shall have no further discussion on this. All right, I yes, guess. I, you may wish to speak with your mother about this before I do. My mother will not like this. Thank you again for rescuing me. We shall speak soon. Grr, your mama gonna kill you. Whoops, I wanted to check on my challenges. That's a scary beak mask.
guess that would be the fastest travel there. Up the stairs we go. Oh. What are these fools doing? What if he sits like this? What? Don't be silly. It'll wear off in a few hours, I think. You think? It didn't before. That other boy was like it for a week. A week? <laughs> Fretting. We'll have you with Nurse Blaney in no time. I've just realized. What? What is it? I have an essay I need to finish for bins. Two inches. Man, I've never <laughs> done mine either. <laughs> oh, I'll see you later, kid. Did you memorize the dates of magical discoveries in Goblin Rebellion? Not yet, no. Where are you going? You can't Rebellion. Me here. You'll be fine. I'll check on you tomorrow. Tomorrow? Uh I can get up there for sure. Binny wig sting. You'll be a week like that. Billy wig stings. You'll be awake like that. Good lord. Alright, how fucking high am I going here? Through the oh, armor hall. I guess we'll get the unlock while we're here, you know? Revenia. Chesty. Chesty. Chesty, a note. Where's the... Out here? Out here. Rebellion. Oh, there's a chesty up here. Okay. Is it just that that's dinging? What the fuck is this? Hey, how do I get a key? Where's that? No. It's probably down here. Oh. 
Oh, hello. Three. Sorry, bro. If I don't have level three. Oh yes, hello. Come to Papa. Yeah. Yep, a bum. Yep, a bum. Bing, bing, bing. Yep, a bum. Pa, pa, bum. Pa, pa, pa. There you are, back in your home. Sherbet lemon. It's not sherbet lemon. Too Wish it was. Pure. I wonder if all the elite wizarding families have a motto. Rebellion. Level three, level two. There's also a wand handle right here. Orbicular. What's up here? Level three, god damn it. Yo, we can just fly from out here. Oh, so we can come back here whenever we need to. The sorting hat. <gasps> He's in a box. How do I? Well, that's in the this door. God damn! I need I need three. It's good to see you. All thanks to Professor Fig's quick thinking. Now what? Approach the pedestal in the antechamber and read the book that appears. Can't read. I suspect there will be more to this than reading a book. Your suspicions are correct. We shall speak when you are finished. Has this been under the headmaster's nose all this time? Is that the pensive? What do we got up here? That must be the pedestal. Ooh. Justy. Spot of tea. Okay. How hard am I going to get obliterated in this trial? Where am I? Whoa! Can you hear me? I am here. In this place, you may call me Eve. You shall be witness to a fable. Pay attention. Things are not always as they seem. You must move swiftly and cautiously. Use the tools you encounter to find me. What is going on? Is a cloak. Make your way through the town without being seen. Uh, okay. <laughs> um, pardon me. I'm just going to take a quick, uh, <laughs> quick thumbnail picture here. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Is that this one? Nope, oh, this one? Nope. 
This one? This one. What? Like, what is this? <laughs> My nightmares. Okay. Let's, uh... Oops, let me turn that back on. Okay, so I need to make it through town without being seen, yes? But I don't have spells. Death takes many forms. Avoid each of them at all costs. What the fuck? <laughs> We're gonna take some, some screenshots here, my guys. <laughs> okay. What the actual hell? I have no spells. Don't mind me. I should have run when I could. I'd be free by now. Why? Why? I best move while I can. Neve must be here somewhere. How? How am I supposed to get past these fucking Skeletors? I need to time this just right. Okay. No, no. Oh my god, this is awful. A staircase straight ahead. Okay, we're moving. We're moving. Ooh. Okay. No, that's fine. Okay. 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 Okay, we're going. Why? 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 What kind of challenge is this? Besides, scary. They're gone. For now. I need to get out of here. Where could Neve be? Many. I must cross this road as fast as I can. To where? We're just going to go, I guess. to 
go, but I need to find a way past them. Uh huh. Look, look away. Look, look. Thank you. Look away. Please. Okay. Okay. No problem. No problems here. Don't mind the crows. Bro, this, like... Sorry, got to, got to take another screenshot. It's 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 too good. It's too good. Like look at look at death over here. Look at that man. We're just gonna be pals with him, I think. Right? Like, he, he can't see us. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. Why would I need Wigan Weld potions? I can't do any spells. Holy! Bro, 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 what is this? Fucking Revelio ain't gonna do dick. What do you mean, now's my chance? Sure, let's just, let's just keep going, right? Yeah, nobody's gonna see me, no one's gonna see crows. That's the way forward. Yeah, sure, stop being invisible now. Great idea. Uh, are we just getting the Deathly Hallows? Question mark? Oh, wait. What? Wait. How do I get back there? Oh, fucking hell. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. oh, okay. <laughs> all right, we're just going. They can't see me at all. I can get closer to them. See you later, chumps. This is the way forward. Finally free. I was literally just here, was I not? Oh, look at the wand. Look at the wand I have. That was Elder Wand for sure. You have outrun death thus far, but have yet to find me. Keep searching, but this time you will be unable to hide. There it is. Wield the wand you see before you. Do not squander its extraordinary power. Deathly Hallows for sure. We're not hiding anymore, baby! I've never felt such power.
Okay. Got a set set of spells. That's fine. All right, who wants who wants some fuck? Where are you at, death boys? Bring it on, chumps. Oh, can't block, can't block that one. Whoa. Okay. Or fighting, please. Kablamo. Locked. Locked. Ouch. Bro, why have we got so many people to fight? Woo! That was a lot of dudes. Oh, I could have been using my cabbages. What am I doing? Don't even need that wiggy weld. Can I go up that? No. I've gotten a little better at fighting, I think, in all the time that I've been playing this game. Alright, another huge fight out here for sure. Holy balls. Hey, Death! Oh, God, okay.
Ain't no way that hit me, bro. And we're dodging, and we're dodging. Hello? What? Another troll? Are you shitting me? Some room here. Oh, 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 oh. No, sir. No, sir. Holy ass. That's enough. That's enough, Death. Yeah, goodbye, please. Oh, why? <laughs> why? Oh, 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 oh. Let me big dodge, please. Okay. Okay, there's a troll gun. Okay, that's enough. Holy shit. Took some hits, took some hits. Okay, so now we just have the resurrection stone.
I'm confused, like, why this is the trial. It's cool. It's, it's different. You're far from finished. Pass through the mourners ahead. Nothing is what it seems. I can't believe she's dead. Oh, poor Neve. Bye. We won't be the same without her. Death. Come on, my guy. Be chill. Be chill. Thanks. Confused about all this? Yeah, for real. Uh You found me. Oh. But you cannot undo what has been done. Uh the magic of the stone can only conjure a shadow of my former self. Okay. We're just gonna go for a walk. Okay, well there's the pensieve. Interesting. But there is no light without shadow, as there is no shadow without light. Simply because you can eliminate darkness does not always mean that you should. Hmm. Remember that. As you witness my memory. Sure, sure. Makes sense. See you later, Queen. Boop. Snag that. In we go. Isadora, what you did for your father was remarkable, wasn't it? And Percival needn't worry about the strands of emotion or the traces that this magic leaves. I found a way to contain all of it. You haven't stopped. Goblin Silver. You spoke to a goblin about oh. it. Don't worry, he has no idea what we're containing. We don't know what effect any of this may have. The emotions, the dark traits. You sound like Percival. And as it happens, I do know. It is a source of strength, of focus. Somehow it enhances my ability to wield magic. I don't follow, Isadora. I think we can harness it. Power like this is not to be toyed with. In the wrong hands. I saw again. what I did for my father. Mia, imagine the good we could do. Everyone is in some kind of pain. Oh, bro, give that back. Did she just eat that? must stop. All of us. You've kept this power to yourselves for so long because you fear it. I choose to embrace it. You tell me you wouldn't just kill this girl like right then and there? Okay, some people, man. Oh, we're not all black and white. Revelia. Where even are we? You are the talk of the school since you saved Mr. Reb and I from the Ashwinders. We have come so far. We should discuss the next steps in our plan to stop Harlow. I have some promising Poppy, news about okay. the location of our Hebridean dragon friend and where to return her, you know what. Meet me in the town circle in Hogsmeade. Okay. And? Nothing from Sebastian still. Come on, bro. Hey, last guy. 
Has someone completed the first three trials? It me. It is, and I have. But you are so... Young. I know. You must be Professor Bacar. I am. Pleased to meet you. The pensive memory I just witnessed. Was Isadora inhaling painful emotions? She was. Disturbing, for that sure. Disturbing. But how did she gain power from it? How did she harness it? It was disturbing. Although, I wonder that you are asking about her power. I hesitate to reveal the location of my pensive to someone who, perhaps, has yet to understand the responsibility of power. Oh, I come on, kid. Professor, I do. In fact, what you don't yet know is that a dangerous goblin called Ranrock has accessed the repository at Rookwood Castle. He has learned to harness the contents of it as a source of immense power. He plans to use that power against wizard kind. We have no time to waste. I see. Nonetheless, the knowledge you shall gain after you witness my memories is too valuable to share without further consideration. I shall require time to confer with the other keepers. Always. What up, Fig? It seems we have no choice but to wait, frustrating as it is. I heard what you told Professor Bakar. Isadora was inhaling emotions to gain power? She was. And she pulled emotions, as she did from her father, from Professor Fitzgerald, without permission. Monstrous. What's more, she said that she found a way to store the traces of magic she extracted in Goblin Silver. The repositories? Possibly. There's something I didn't get a chance to tell you earlier. Ranrock has been digging at locations tied to the five names he found in the journals of a goblin metal worker named Bragball. Five names? The Keepers, and who else? Isadora Morganak? Precisely. That's how he's been one step ahead of us. Gringotts, the Tower, Rookwood Castle. If the Keepers won't tell you where the next trial is yet, I say we at least maintain a watch on Ranrock. Perhaps he'll lead us to more information. Perhaps. I hope to hear from Lodgok soon. I haven't heard anything since I learned of the drills. Oh, and as you've probably guessed by now, your Polyjuice plan worked like a charm. I knew it would. I may have done too good a job distracting Black. I had no idea he can't hold his fire whiskey. <laughs> Wield a Deathly Hollow. Hmm. So, like, can I get those? I think I have a lot of gear I need to deal with. Oh, and some undiscovered stuff. Wait, how much was this? 26? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go to, uh... Oh wait, what did we get? Ah, oh, the nobules? Meh. Gonna hit up the rumor requirement. We're gonna identify some shiz. Gonna sell some shiz. I shouldn't have reacted so bitterly about your oh. friend. I apologize. I hope we can finish what we started with the triptych. Please meet me at the southern coast. We can search for the final canvas piece. Well, there you go. Have some exciting news to share. Where we got almost done with the game. Oh, oh, right, two tone gloves. Well. 
a 16 offense, bro. That's a lot. Ugh, but... I might just upgrade this. Ugh, I don't know. I don't know. What the frickin' F? Why I got so much shit? I'll have to wait for better glasses, I think. What was I doing? Oh yes, yes, yes. Let's look at our let's look at the quests we got here. Oh, we got a lot of shit to do. Phoenix rising. Okay. That's how we're gonna catch the Phoenix. We gotta do that next time for sure. Uh he's gonna teach us Bombarda? Or we need Bombarda. We'll do that next time, too. Man, big stuff. Big stuff. Sheesh. Okay. All right. That is, uh, that's where we're going to leave it off for now. Pretty wild ride. Uh, only a few quests. That's that's pretty big. That's pretty big. Um, kind of sad. Kind of sad it's coming to an end. But I'm sure there's other stuff that we can do. All right, guys. Thank you so much for hanging out as always. And I will catch you in the next episode. Goodbye.